welcome back to my channel. So I know many of you are very excited for this unboxing of the March 2021 Honey Bee Shop Babe Box because it is Disney themed. So I am, I'm just gonna go ahead and like preface this. I am a Disney fan, but I'm not like as big of a fan as a lot of people um, that I know. So I'm very excited for this, but I definitely won't be like totally biased toward loving it because I'm not like, I'm a Disney fan, but I'm not a like complete fanatic, if, if that makes any sense. Like I just, I know people who love Disney more than I do. So I just want to put that out there. Um, but the thing that I love about Disney is number one, the just nostalgia and it makes me think about being a kid and like simpler times. But number two, I have family who, um, lives near Disney and goes to Disney pretty often and just Disney makes me think of them. So that's a big reason why I love uh, Disney stuff. But I'm really, really excited about this because it's it's a different take on Disney. Um, and so let's just, yeah, let's just go, let's get into it. Oh, that is so pretty. Okay, so we're gonna start here because this is the journaling card that has what we get in this box on the back. Um, it's a small world. Are you kidding? That is so cute. So I'm probably, she probably won't watch this. Um, I'm probably going to mail this to my sister-in-law because I think she would adore this. I know they love the, it's a small world. So now this I'm going to have to keep for myself because I'm a huge up fan. So <laughs> I'm going to have to keep that one. I love that. Okay. So let's see. So the theme of the box is titled Tattoo Sidekicks. And this month we get two journal cards, which is what we have right here. Six pattern papers, one foiled acetate sheet, one foiled vellum sheet, super excited because we haven't had vellum in a few months. A 10 page sticker book, 15 millimeter foiled washi. Ah! And, or that's this one. And then three five millimeter foiled washies. This is clear washi, I'm so excited. A vinyl die cut pack, which is that. A mouse pen, which is here, which is so cute. Adhesive pockets, I'm really excited because I actually don't have any adhesive pockets somehow. And a new jelly sticker keeper. This is what I'm most excited for. Oh my God, I'm so, let's go. So I guess let's just start with the pen since I'm holding it. Um, first off, very nice weight to this pen. Seems very, ooh, very nice quality. It does look like it's ballpoint, which is interesting because I've actually been um, kind of missing my ballpoint pens. I haven't used one in a while. I really got on like the gel pen trains. I, I usually, I use gel pens and I use um, like felt tip. So yeah, I like that. Very nice, good to have a nice ballpoint pen lying around. It's very professional looking, very cute. Oh my God, I, I don't even know where to start. Okay, let's just start here. Let's start with the die cuts. Okay, <laughs> so like I said, I'm a Disney fan, but not the hugest Disney fan. So there's gonna be some things in here that I don't know what the characters are. So just, just, just bear with me. I know it's gonna make some of y'all cringe, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna start looking here. So first of all, I love the different skin tones that you get. I know we always get different skin tones, but I just, I love it. Oh, look at the little Winnie the Pooh inspired one. Oh, that is so cute. Corella DeVille, she's cute. We got another Winnie the Pooh. Oh, oh my God. That is Oh my God, the chip dress, like, okay. Beauty and the Beast, very, very cute. This is Alice in Wonderland. Oh, we got Tinkerbell, yes. Lilo and Stitch, look at the Stitch tattoo on her leg. See that, oh. Oh, this is another Winnie the Pooh. Yes, this is Piglet. Oh, it's Piglet. I. This is really cool because it's, it's subtle. I, I love how subtle it is, it's really cool. It's just different. I just, I love, I love Lilo and Stitch. Oh my God. Big Hero 6. 
amazing. Oh, yes, honey, come through with the fishnets. Go ahead, Jasmine. Oh, my God, I love. Mm. Oh, yes. <laughs> the little mermaid, look how cute that is. Her hair, yes, honey. Nemo and Dory. It's th that's what that is, right? Nemo, yep. Nemo and Dory. See, I really, I really like this. Oh my gosh, look how cute. I really like this because again, it's, it's Disney, but it's not in your face Disney. So it's got that cool kind of like, you know, like Easter egg kind of, kind of feeling like, oh yeah, I see what that is. This bow is very cute. That is, that's cute. Look at that. Yes, the gargoyle. That's what I'm talking about is the gargoyles. I love that. Oh, shit. So, yeah, the die cuts, incredibly cute. Um, I love, again, I say this every month, but I love how many you get. You, you get so many. I love being able to share them with people. Like, you get so many that it's so easy to share. You just throw them in with some happy mail. I'm going to send my sister-in-law and... Um, my nieces and nephews a little like goodie package with this stuff because they you know they live at disney they love it and i think they'll just be really surprised with the stuff so it's great that i get to share it and there's so much to go around you know it's not like i'm gonna be missing out on anything so love the die cuts okay i have to get in, i have to get in the oh my god full box sticker pack somehow i i skipped over that it's a full box sticker pack okay I'm here for it. I love it. Perfect. I love it. Okay. Only look back to see how far you have come with the Winnie the Pooh. That is super cute. I love. Ohana means family. Family means no one gets left behind. Today's special moments are tomorrow's memories. This is so great too for, like, I already know I'm going to be hoarding this stuff for whenever we can inevitably uh, get back to Disney with our family. This will be so great for me for memory keeping. Okay, so we're going to get into the sticker book. I'm very excited. Oh my god. And after we get into the sticker book, we're going to open this bad boy. Because y'all, I am so... Oh my god, I'm so excited. Can I, can I just say, let me just stop and say real quick. What a great value this is. Like... If you're somebody like myself who is on a limited budget with this kind of stuff, you know, I barely place orders on shops. I, I don't really buy sticker kits. I find them to be kind of pricey and I don't, I've just been really trying to like not buy a bunch of stuff because I have so much stuff. Getting this every month, like I can be happy just getting this every month, $30. And I get stickers every month. And this is more than one spread. You get multiple spreads with this. Um, you get all these die cuts. You get, like, this alone would be, like, $20. Like, yeah. Washi? Like, yeah. It's just a great value. Okay. We're going to get into our sticker book here. This is a 10-page sticker book. So we have our full boxes here on the front. I love, I love this up one so much. I love these and the castle. Again, I just think this is going to be so great for me for memory keeping. And whenever we can, you know, plan a trip to Disney, I can do my spread and my catch all that week with the, like, I'm just, it makes me excited to, you know, start planning that trip. Um, yeah, eventually we'll, we'll get there. Faith, trust, and pixie dust. Very cute. Magical pass holder. These are very cute. I love all the hollow. So pretty. Oh, these boxes. The fireworks. These boxes are so pretty. Oh my gosh. These are awesome. The hollow is so. I love it. It says adventures, royal duties. Come on. That's so cute. Yes. They're little hollow icons. I love these. There's my favorite one every month. 
so cute. Oh my gosh, look at them. Look at these checklists. Look how cute that is. Oh my God. The cart. That is so stinking cute. Oh, I love it. Oh, and then we have our babes here in the back. These are cool. Oh, they're so cute. I love that she did the gargoyles. I, I love that. Oh, man, these are awesome. It's just so creative. It's so... It's so, like, out of the box from what you normally see. Like, for example, like, Happy Planner Disney stuff. While that stuff is, you know, beautiful and it's fine, this is just, like, it's so different, you know? I mean, look at these. Oh, my God. So cute. I, I love it. When I saw this, I lost my mind. So, if you don't know what this is, this, oh my gosh, this is a sticker book keeper. So they call it a sticker keeper, okay? And I've never used one of these, so I'm, I'm figuring this out too. Now I know from the traveler's notebooks, you stick this in here. And you kind of pull that through and then this holds it together, right? So this strap in here, um, and I, I should look at the account because I, yeah, I didn't see how this would be used, but I mean, I'm pretty sure this would just be used to like hold this together and also you could like hang another sticker book on it. But here's what's great. So if you get the bait box every month, like I do, I have these just loosely in my planner cart here. I have a little like box that holds my stickers and this is great because then I can slide them in here and easily see what I have. They fit in there perfectly. So I'm having a complete brain fart and can't remember what the February box was. I'm gonna insert it here. I, I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, so I know that sticker book is in a different room. And then the past sticker books that I have, because I've only been a Babe Box subscriber since October 2020, or September. It was Personality Crisis 2.0. And so I actually, I had the bright idea to like break down the sticker books one time. I was like, oh yeah, I'll just, I'll put them in here and I won't do that again. Um, I find that, and it, I mean, it could just be this paper, but I just find the stickers are kind of hard to get off of here and I just... Now that I have this, it's going to make it a lot easier for me to, like, organize my sticker books because they, they just fit in here perfectly. So this is, I mean, this is definitely, I haven't gotten to the papers or the washi or the adhesive pockets, but this is my favorite. I just think this is, it, it's awesome. It's beautiful. You get, um, you get a decent amount of, of pages here. It smells really good. It has that nostalgic smell of you know like photo albums like that you used to be able to get at Walmart like when you would go and you would get your film developed and yeah I know that's like really silly but I just absolutely adore this. Now there is this is a pocket as well here on the front so you could slide hold on hold on hold on light bulb going off in my brain check it out girl oh my god this is perfection. I am so in love with this and happy to look at this every single day. I love it. Absolutely love it. Oh my god. Love it. Okay, let's do the adhesive pockets. Oh my goodness, these are cute. So if you've never used an adhesive pocket before, um, you just kind of like stick it on like a dashboard in your planner or on like the inside cover. And it just holds like, like if you wanted to hold on to some stickers that you, you know, didn't, you weren't ready to like put down yet, but you just want to kind of hold on to them, you can stick them in there. Some people use them to hold like little paper clips, um, little like sticky notes or little notes to just tuck away. But it's so great to, to have these. And I really love this. I love that the Green Army Man is on there um, for Toy Story. I, I just, 
These are just so pretty. They're so pretty. I love it. I love that you get different sizes. You get four of them. It's great. I'm, I'm excited to use those throughout my different journals and planners. All right, y'all, let's get into this washi. Now, this seal, I think I'm going to have to try to keep intact. Okay. Now we're going to try... Is that, is this, is this an ASMR channel now? I mean, I'm okay with it. See, like, I only save the, like, special ones. Yeah. All right. So, if you have been on my channel before, you know that clear washi is my jam. I love clear washi. This is all, I believe this is all. This is all my clear washi I currently own. It's all from the Honeybee Shop. Um... And yeah, so clearly I like clear washi. And quite a bit of this has come from Bay Boxes. This was from, this one has the days of the week on it. It's hard to see when it's not rolled out. But um, this was from the Book Gazer Bay Box, I believe. And then, oh, I'm missing the gold one because I used it when I was doing my layout, my catch all. It's in a different room, but there's a little, a gold one that's perforated. Um, so this isn't all of it, but y'all look how pretty that is i am always down for a new clear washi uh, that sounded like i said a new clear washi i'm not down for a new clear washi but i'm down for new clear washi and uh yeah that is very very pretty go ahead and i'll probably put it on the bottom since it's thick she's thick and then we're going to open up these teeny tiny ones, the five millimeter, which personally I probably use more. I use the smaller ones more. Just, I don't know, just cause. Okay, so we have this cute little gray one. Very, very cute and perforated. So these are perfect for your headers. Um, for full boxes, it's, you know, that standard, like, inch and a half size. So it's great for, you know, using on your headers in your planner. Okay, and then we have a black one. It's the same. It's perforated. I'm not going to roll that one out. And it's got that beautiful hollow. And then this one, I don't remember what it is. I'm not sure if I even saw. Okay, so it's the same design, but it's clear. So I love that. It's clear and it's black. But, mm. I love, and it's perforated. Yeah, love that. And the last thing, which is typically my favorite, except this month, I don't think it's going to beat out this because this is amazing. But I actually have a video coming up. Now, I have I have filmed it, and it's within a video on my channel. Um, I believe it's the one where I'm doing a makeover on my social media planner, which I actually that isn't even my social media planner anymore. Yeah, I have a couple videos coming up. I have a updated planner stack video, and then I have how to use these papers or any cardstock to create your own dividers in your planner. Whether you have a ring bound or a disc bound, it's very simple to create your own dividers. And I'll show you my laminator and how I turn these into dividers for my planner. So enough babbling, let's get into this. So you get two of each and they are double-sided. So let's see what the other side is. Oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful. Now, if you have a half letter planner, let me just tell y'all, making dividers for a half letter size is so easy and great because this is eight and a half by 11, which is letter size. So you literally just have to cut it in half and then you have your divider. It's amazing. So you have your cute little mini bows and then, oh, Look how cute with the little planner and the pen cup. Oh, these are so adorable. Okay, and then you have the castles and the fireworks. Oh my, how cute. And then y'all, my favorite part, always my favorite part. Yes. Ooh, we have our acetate. 
Oh my god. And we get Vellum this month. I love Vellum. I love Vellum. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. This is going to be so great in my memory keeping. I'm going to turn these into inserts for my B6TN where I have my memory keeping uh, insert. This is going to be a great like dashboard. To Oh my gosh, this is going to be so great. I am so excited. These, for this month, these will likely all end up in my traveler's notebook. Um, because, like I said, you know, I'm not... I'm not like somebody who's gonna have Disney in their their everyday planner, so I would definitely like to keep these in where I have my memory keeping, um, and that would just make more sense in my head because, yeah, when I go to Disney, it would definitely be, you know, a big uh, memory keeping moment. I'll be with my family who I haven't seen since November 2019 because of the panty. So, um, got my first vaccine and I'm due for my second one very soon, and I'm very excited. So, um. Yeah, so this box, um, if I had to give this a score, I don't do this every month. I don't know. Let me let me know if you guys like, do, you know, putting a number on it. If I had to give this box, like, from 1 to 10, with 1 being absolute trash and 10 being the greatest thing I've ever seen in my life, for me, for me, oh, this is tough. I gotta say this box is a 10 and again that's coming from somebody who's not like the world's biggest Disney fan but this box is like to me is like the epitome of value and like the reason I get the babe box every month there have been a couple um and you know every month's not gonna be perfect I mean, just just like anything else but there have been a couple where there have been some misses and things where you're like Oh, did I really get my money's worth this month? And this month is like, I absolutely got my money's worth. Like, 100%. Um, I mean, again, like, this jelly sticker keeper alone would be $20. And you get this beautiful, like, really nice pen. You get the washi, the adhesive pockets, the papers, the sticker book, the extra sticker sheets, the die cuts. Like, it, it's it's a great value. So, honestly, I can't give this any lower than a 10. I really can't. Um, it's great quality. It's, you know, it, yeah, it's great. So <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this. I definitely did. I'm so excited to create, um, you know, using this stuff. And also again, because you get so much stuff, um, which for some people I think may be like a reason they don't get it every month. Cause maybe they don't like have enough, maybe they don't like use enough, you know, different planners or notebooks or anything to justify, to them, you know, getting all this stuff every month. Like, it might not even be about the price for them. It might just be like, what am I going to do with this stuff every month? Um, for me, that's that's not an issue. I, I was worried about it at first when I subscribed. I was like, really? Am I going to use this stuff every month? And I do. Um, I, I really, truly do. And because you get so much, I always end up sharing. And I love being able to share with friends. Um, you know, maybe my friend skips out on the bay box that month because they don't have the money. I share with them. Um, and then you get the digital bay box. So when you run out of stickers, you can, if you, you know, have sticker paper, you have a printer. And if you happen to have a cutting machine, it makes it even easier. Because um, I got a Cricut for Christmas. Thanks, Mom. And so now I can print out these stickers. I can print out the digitals and make my own stickers. Now, I, I don't have the ability to do... Or I don't know how to do hollow yet. So I don't do any hollow stuff. But I love being able to print, you know, extras. My favorite designs. And just really get creative with the digital. So, yeah. I gotta say 10 out of 10 this month. Love it. I, the creativity of these. It's just awesome. I'm definitely gonna share these. I can't wait to share some of this with my family. They're gonna really love it and be very surprised. Um... And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Also subscribe. That really, really helps me out. And share this video. Share this with somebody who you think might be interested. Um, if you are interested in the Honeybee Shop Babe Box, um, please go check it out. So I have a link in my bio to the Honeybee Shop website. And that will get you, if you use my link, that will, it's a referral link, and it will get you 15% off your order. 
and I get points in return for that. So I'll get points and then that will allow me to have like a discount off of my next order. So I don't get money when you use my link per se, but kind of in a way. So um, that will not apply for the Babe Box, but if you go to the Honeybee Shop website, you can see the link to the Babe Box. But I encourage you to check out the Honeybee Shop, um, even if you don't use my link. Just, uh, it's a great shop. It's a great, you know, it's a small business. Um, they, you know, just the, it's amazing. The quality's great. Um, yeah, I love it. I couldn't be happier. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. And, uh, I have a couple more videos going up very soon. I've been working hard. Um, got some new posts over on my Instagram. Go and check that out. My podcast, I did launch a podcast called Pixels and Planners. So please check that out. I have the link in the description. And yeah so i will uh oh and i launched a patreon so if you're interested in that that's in my bio as well all right y'all so i will check in with y'all soon i hope you have a great rest of your day and i don't know how to sign off bye